welcome back to another episode of Coco's Kitchen. If you haven't yet subscribed, please subscribe now. Like and comment. Today's recipe, we will be making deviled eggs stuffed with tuna fish. So for this recipe, it's simple. It's the normal stuff you normally make with your tuna fish. I forgot to put the mayo in the relish out, but I'll get that. So you need mayonnaise, um, relish, some sandwich bread, salt, mustard. I'm putting black pepper and a little sprinkle of garlic. I've already pre-cooked the eggs. And if you want to use tuna for this recipe or chicken or either one. So when we come back, oh, and I forgot, I chopped up some onion that I need to continue to chop. So when I come back, we'll get started making the tuna. the tuna I already deshelled the eggs and we're about to get started now when you make tuna it's a lot of different ways to make tuna some people probably gonna complain that the way I'm making mine but you make yours to your liking so let's get started I prefer the tuna also in oil myself, so you can get the one in water or whatever you like. Then I'm just going to add to this a little splash of garlic. Get it come out. A little bit of black pepper. I'm using a little bit of white onion. Also, I normally use... Um, red onions but I don't have one so a tiny squirt of mustard And throw some of these onions. I tried to dice up the best that I could. I'm not good at dicing. And when I, let me start mixing it around. And with the egg, because all I want is the center, I'm going to have to mix this up a little more. And I got to add the relish. It's in the refrigerator. But let me just show you all we're going to do. Because you can make your tuna or whatever you're going to stuff the egg with however you want it, but I'm just cutting the egg in half. I'm gonna save the inside. Let me get a little plastic knife. I got to get my little dish out for the egg, but we are just gonna keep doing repeating this step until we're finished. And then when we come back, we'll be ready to stuff it. I'm going to do some little more to this tuna fish. But when I come back, we'll finish okay, it up. I've already finished making the tuna. So now I was stuffing the eggs. And you can use chicken. I made this with chicken instead of tuna. And you make it the same way you make tuna. And all you do is stuff it. And I had it at a birthday party or graduation. I did this for Christmas and Thanksgiving. So it's something good. I mean, just try it. And it don't take long to do. And it's just like, you know, make your tuna and make some chicken and stuff it. Now, when we come back, I'll be have, I'll have them already done. And then um, we'll wrap it okay, up. Okay, I just pulled them out the refrigerator. I had them in the refrigerator for like 10 or 15 minutes or until they get cold enough for you. And I'm just going to sprinkle a little paprika on it. Sometimes I use black pepper. It doesn't matter if you don't even have to do this. You can sprinkle some parsley on it. But it tastes just like tuna fish. I mean, it tastes like a tuna fish, except it's not on bread. So this is how it looks at the end. Thanks for watching my video. And if you haven't subscribed, subscribe, like, share, and comment. And I'll see you next time. Bye.